46 years. That's how long it's been since the Air Force Falcons have played the Colorado Buffaloes in football. That is until today. It was a huge rivalry in the 60s, but the two schools ended it in the height of the Vietnam War. And today, the Falcons went to Boulder. And two neighbors, one Air Force grad and one CU fan, went to see them. Our Michael Abeda talked to them, and Michael, they have had very different memories of this rivalry. Well, Jamie, the Vietnam War era was a very contentious time in our nation's history. And quite frankly, a lot of the cadets that went to the academy and came up to Boulder to see those games back then just didn't feel welcome here because a lot of the students opposed the war. Well, a lot of time has passed, and both CU buffs and Falcon fans are hoping that the only differences they have these days can be settled on the football field. It's a perfect day, two great teams. It's a rivalry straight out of Colorado's past. This is, for those of us that grew up in Colorado, a real rivalry. Roy Palmer lives in Littleton and is a lifelong CU fan. He remembers watching the Air Force Academy from down in Colorado Springs battle it out on the gridiron with his buffs. I remember the cadets and how excited they were and, you know, how difficult it was to beat Air Force. His neighbor David Wagner remembers it a little differently. Unfortunately, I think a lot of them were very personal. He graduated from the Academy in 1969 and remembers coming up to Boulder to watch those games. He didn't exactly feel like the CU fans were good hosts. The Vietnam War affected a lot of the tenor of the game. We were not welcome. I, I was actually turned away from a couple bars showing a military ID. But that was nearly half a century ago. The fans at Saturday's game seemed to understand it was just about football. The atmosphere here seems to be very friendly, which is something that I find unusual. And while Roy and Dave may not be rooting for the same team, there is one thing they can agree on. They want to see this Colorado Classic played more often. I would love to see him play every year. I think it's good for Colorado. Uh, I think it's a great game. We're going to have a state champion this year. Well, Air Force did beat CU in an overtime thriller, so now if they beat CSU, I suppose they'll win that unofficial state championship. Air Force and CU will play again in 2022. That'll be down in Colorado Springs. In Boulder, Michael Aveta covering Colorado first.